So guys, we're still with our Kenyan boyfriend. Yeah. Guess what? He's blessed. He has two girlfriends. Two. <laughs> I'm telling two. you. <laughs> two. So. I got two guys. <laughs> so stick with us. Let us see what this video brings on yep. table. So come Videos. with us, guys. I'm telling you. Yep. Come with us. Let me take this two of my thick Ugandan friends where I stay. Let's see what happens. <laughs> I'm telling you, <laughs> we are outside though. <laughs> so guys, this is still Nyabohansi. It's a village, guys, at the deepest village in Kenya. Actually, after this village, you find the Tanzanian border. Guess what? The roads are super clear, even in the deepest villages of Kenya. What does that mean? Everywhere you go in Kenya, transportation is very easy. Because the roads are good. Just after this village, the next village is Isbania, the border of Kenya and Tanzania, guys. We are deep, 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 deep in the village, but the roads are super, super good. All right, thank you so much for coming back on this beautiful YouTube channel. It's Mishami Vlog, the girl from Uganda, a proud Ugandan, right here in Nyabohansi, Kenya. All right, and right now we're going at the dam. It's going to be the very first video you see me near the dam. I've never seen a dam in my life. I always thought dams are natural, but then they told me it's, dams are not natural. So we're going to go there. And I have a super surprise for you. Guess what? I'll have someone who is taking us out, and he's Kenyan. Stay tuned to watch and. Pizza. Mm. So now you're my But I you love it. You want us to enter? Yeah. Oh, oh, we yeah, we are rushing. Yeah. Yeah. But we can go. We can yeah. enter. I would love to. You'd love to. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. So guys, check on that calmness of the water. Actually, this is Kenya Nyabohansi. Very okay. <laughs> wow. Remember, we have to rotate like this. Yeah. Yeah, we'll take time and we have So, guys, currently they have brought us at the Quigancha Earth Dam in Nyabohansi, Kenya. Let me tell you guys if you don't walk a lot, you may think your uh, compound or your country is the most beautiful place on the earth. Guess what? We found a very beautiful place right here. And we love it. Say hi. Just rotate and look around. Okay, say hi. Yeah, hi. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, we came on time and he's insisting us to enter inside. Though we don't have a lot of time right now, tomorrow I'm going to come back and enter. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And shout out to Mara. Let me tell you, this guy told us, please, Cindy, Murikuja kwa Mara, just enter. Yes. Mara, we love you a lot. <laughs> So that is it. I, I love it. Is it a natural dam? It is a natural dam. So it was not created? Not created. This is a natural dam. It's a natural dam. Yeah. Oh, that's very neat to me. Guys, let me know like if there are natural dams because it's the first natural dam I've seen in my life. Yeah. It is a natural dam, but because of the government, the revenue and the whatever, they mm. tried to reno renovate. That's mm. why they fence so what is inside the dam are there is there yeah, fish? fish and uh, to help the community how does it help the community no you you know you can walk around mm. there is a that tank mm. there is a machine inside there mm. and then actually pump some water there to help cows cows drink water there mm. and then uh, people to wash clothes mm. and then there is a 
uh, toilets there and then uh, bathroom, people shower outside the dam. Oh. Not to come and uh, interfere and... Uh, so how about the fish inside the dam? Yeah. Fish are they okay? Do you sell the fish? Yeah. But oh, since the renovation, well, they have never come to yeah. fish the fish. Oh, mm. yeah. that's so beautiful if you're helping the community and yes. yes. Help the community in that way. We love it. Thank yeah. you. What's your name? My name is Armayani John. Amara. Ay, I am Mara. I am Mayani. Oh my God. Oh, you want to have a YouTube channel? <laughs> <laughs> you have a YouTube no, channel? I don't, don't want to, you, to tell me I give you my challenge. We can but, support. Uh, you. No, can support we can support, like, support your channel. You. Mm. We subscribe. can follow you and subscribe. But uh, maybe let me. I will come tomorrow there. At Mara. <laughs> uh, yeah. Okay. No problem. So guys, this is there. our. Our oh, Kenyan boyfriend, please come. <laughs> I'm here, Mama. <laughs> He's the one and only, yes, the dumb Clinton finder. The Check me out. Clinton the oh explorer, my, you, you know. get it, you get it, mm -hmm. you get it. Yeah. That's the man. So how do you find the vibe around here? I love it. Okay. I, I love She's it. She's called too. Atis, Atieno, by the way. Atieno. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and that, that one is at Biambo. Mm -hmm. yeah. Ugandan ladies. I'm telling oh, you. Very smart. Oh. Ah, oh, Ugandan ladies. <laughs> You're ladies. doing better. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Talk to this guy. Talk, talk to this guy. No, this is a natural dam. It's a natural dam? Yeah. So guys, it's a natural, 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 natural dam. Let me tell you one thing. This dam helps the community. You see, they've even planted some vegetables there. How does it help the community? For example, they built for it some tanks. They pump water and put chemicals in the water. They supply water to the community through this dam. It's a natural dam. They also have toilets for the locals. I just love everything. I love nature, guys. I love it. So, and guys, the weather today has been so good. I love the sunset. Yeah. <laughs> and the fact that Kenya, they have nice roads. I love it. Guys, please check him out. Yeah, go check me out, Clinton the Explorer. Mm. I do travel content. Yeah. I call myself the second travel commander of Tamara, you know, because oh. I love going to difficult, risky places when I travel. Okay. Yeah, I'm attracted to, I'd say, I embrace pain in my life. So mm. I like going to places where, okay, okay, maybe places where the media has painted as this place is risky. Okay. So I'm the kind of a person who always wants to go find for myself. Let me tell you. There is a place in, on top of Mount Elgon, it's called Wanale Falls. Uh -huh. Even the natives of that land, okay. some of them had never reached there. Uh -huh. Here I am, a girl from Kampala, yes. as thick as I am. Uh -huh. I, I told these well, people, you know what, I'm going at that mountain yes. and alone. Uh -huh. Everyone was like, even us, we've never been there, we're uh, you're 30s, risking. We're, you're risking. <laughs> Guess what? Yes. I hit the road. And you I it. went on top of the fall. Do you know on top on of the? Top. I'm telling you. How was the experience? I want to go back. <laughs> you want to go back? I'm you telling need to bring you. Me along. You need to bring me along. Come to you Uganda. I'll take you. Bring... <laughs> by the by the, I might be going, uh, traveling to Uganda this December. Okay. While I was in Uganda in uh, in April, I made a lot of friends there. So I received an invite uh -huh. of one of my friends there. There's this three-day event that will be happening. I don't know where exactly, but I was invited so i might be coming to uganda by oh, day. please this come between uh 14th and 16th of december okay oh. yeah oh, you but sure you're, you you sure. might be here i might be here but i'm still wearing the option uh, you know uh, the party will actually the big one month party will actually be ending on 18th mm. yeah yep and you know me i am not a resident like this is not where i stay oh mm. where do you stay i stay in nairobi, nairobi. oh I you're a city moved, guy yeah yeah i'm a city guy okay. but i love the village you know yeah. for the little time i've been around um Fallen in love with the village. Okay. Previously, I used to like, oh, I don't like the village, village life. But look, two thick women in the village. I love the village. I love Actually, the village. I was also telling people that Mara's yeah. village can make you shift from the city very to true. the village. Very true, yeah. very true, very true. Like for me, you see, I came, I stayed for like two weeks, and then I was like, oh, I need to go back. Hmm. So that's when I decided I'm coming back. And now it's like almost a month. Here in, uh, in Nyabohansi. Oh. Yep. 
Okay. So it's yeah. Yeah, everything has just been awesome, perfect. And actually, that the that security here is really tight. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Actually, even moving at night, mm -hmm. I can feel safe even moving at night. Very, very safe. Yes, but but I li I like to say you don't risk. Don't actually yeah. risk. It might look safe, yes. But it's always good to be ahead of the game. You know? Yeah, exactly. And it's always good to take care of yourself. Mm. When you are like doubting yourself, don't take the risk. It's mm. always good like get to the house. Like personally for me, I always ensure by eight I'm in the house. Oh. If I'm not in the house, or maybe I'm at the party and ensure when I'm coming back, I'm coming back with at least five or six people that we know each other. Oh, okay. yes. Yeah, you know why I was saying it, it's Chinda safe. Uh -huh. Back home. Yeah. You can't work with your gadgets at past nine. Yeah. Past nine. They will take everything from you. Ah. But then here, yes. you I lost my phone recently at the villa. Okay. Guess what? I started calling on my phone and oh. someone who had my phone, yes. this person was struggling to receive uh -huh. and communicate with me. Uh -huh. You understand? I lost yes. it, but then I found it after some an hour. After one hour? Yeah. Ah. Actually, they were even looking for me because that's, I have my wallpaper. Oh, on the phone. Oh, on the screen server. Yeah. Then when I, I, when I got to them, they were like, how do they receive on such phones? <laughs> <laughs> this is an iPhone. Yeah. That's the reason I see Some of us are not used to iPhones, you know. <laughs> and they yeah. started even apologizing. Mm -hmm. We are sorry we found it some time back. Uh -huh. You were calling, we're trying to receive, but how do they receive? I was like, oh my God. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In yeah. Kampala, they will take it. Somebody will just pick it and gone. Yeah. So now where are you taking us? Uh, I think we passed by like my place. Maybe okay. you guys just see. It's okay, we're uh, in for where it. I stay, uh, it's a small, I don't know, I don't know how to describe it. Mm. Uh, it's where I'm like just putting up for the time that I'm here at the party. Mm. Yeah, and uh, maybe you guys can come just go check it out and tell right. me what you guys think. So yeah. how many YouTubers have you visited like their homes? I really want to visit each and every YouTuber's home uh, in Yawahansi. Like personally, the homes of YouTubers that I've visited. Mm. Not really, not really. I've just let's just say Marwa and Marwa's mm. family. Only. Yeah, yeah. That's why most, we're here actually. Because yeah, most of the time, you know, we've been at the villa there. Mm. When you wake up in the morning, after you're done with your morning routine, you just shoot to the villa. Yeah. yeah so that has been the like the whole routine all through. So guys, we're still with our Kenyan boyfriend. Yeah. Guess what? He's blessed. He has two girlfriends. Two. <laughs> I'm telling two. you. <laughs> two. So. I got two guys. <laughs> so stick with us. Let us see what this video brings on yep. table. So come Videos. with us, guys. I'm telling you. Yep. Come with us. Let me take these two of my thick Ugandan friends where I stay. Let's see what happens. <laughs> I'm telling you, <laughs> we are outside though. <laughs>